Hello guys, in this video I want to show you how to install Eduke32 on a Linux based computer. Um, in my case it's KDE Neon, it's Ubuntu based, so it will work if you have a Ubuntu based distribution. Alright, thanks again to Hendrix266 who made this simple tutorial. Um, I enhanced it a little bit. This one is in the description below. That's everything what you need to install it and yeah, we will go by it step by step. First of all, you need to copy and paste this one over here into a terminal. And have everything installed because it did it before. Okay, then you need to have installed subversion. It's for the SVN command to get the files. Just install this one or have it installed. Then you need to download all the eduke32 files. It can take a moment. Okay, it's completed. You will find the folder right here where everything is. And now we have to make it. So we are now in the home folder and we have to go to the eduke folder that was just created right now and then we just type in make and now he builds everything in here so we can execute the files Okay, we're finished now. So we got a eduk32 up and running without any problems. And I purchased on Steam the Atomic Edition, the Megaton Edition I think on Steam. And that's why it's detecting every game I have, as I did not have to copy anything in here. Now you can just run it and it will run. That's no problem at all, but we want to install Duke Plus 2. So onto the Duke Plus website, just click on download, save the file. Then I have it here, Duke Plus, extract, extract, Duke Plus 240, that's the newest version. Then we just need to copy this file onto the eduk32. Paste one folder in here. Okay, now that's done. Click right mouse button, create a new file, call it test. Then we rename it um, dukeplus.sh. Click on open with Kate. Copy and paste this one over here to that one over here. Save it, minimize. Then go to properties, permission, and make it executable. Then just double click it, execute, and it will run. And we can click on start. Duke Plus on the bottom corner. So guys, that's it for the tutorial. I hope you had fun doing it and it was pretty straightforward and easy for you. I will put this one over here in the description below that it will be easy for you to execute. And have a good day and have fun. Till then.